and I'm gonna tell you a lot of things in this video that may you don't know and then you can use for your future or you can share with someone in your family that's pregnant or gonna get pregnant so, so when hi guys welcome back to our channel and I am back to YouTube so before I start my video today I just want to be very clear with you guys I do have a reason why I disappear for a month or so from YouTube and I'm really preparing myself to make this video to explain to you guys because I really think you all should know after I got a lot of questions asking me why what is the reason or are you not doing YouTube anymore so I really think I need to share with you guys I have a reason and be ready because the video is coming up so but today I am here beyond excited to tell you guys I got a beautiful invitation with moms from Drake's Nest vlog she's amazing so she invited me and two other moms to make this collaboration video all these moms they are so amazing I learned so much with them and I'm pretty sure you will too you don't forget I'm gonna link everything in this description box and I will also put it here so you guys can see oh, here, oh, here. You guys can see. so let's go ahead and start this video so the theme of this video is a budget what it's amazing don't you think we have so many things to share and I have to share it with you guys this past 12 months you know my son is one year old I can't believe last year and exactly moment I had a new birth so in this past 12 months I learned a lot of things about baby in how to budget so this video I will share with you guys my five things may you think you need but you don't so when I got pregnant first I in my mind I was always thinking like oh my god I am so excited I want to buy baby stuff for the first thing you do and then you get in a baby store they attract you with the baby register for your baby shower or something like that so if you want to do a simple baby register there so when you go ahead and sign up for this baby register, you're gonna see a big list of things. And they're gonna call this baby essentials. Now I'm thinking, when they say baby essentials, I am just like, are you kidding me? That is not even essential. I never need it. I never use it. So that's a really true thing. When you're first time mom, don't worry. You're gonna have all these moments that you're gonna think. Oh my god, I'm gonna need that. Oh, I need to buy that. Oh, if they say so, please. So my opinion about this baby essential that it has in these uh, baby stores, it's like, my first thought was like, I cannot, I cannot afford to have a baby. Oh, all these items that they list in here is just beyond expense to me. I cannot afford it. Here goes my number one thing that you may think you need. What you don't. Number one, bassinet. Seriously, they're so cute. Everyone has one. You're not gonna know your baby until you have your baby. This mother here got three types of bassinet, and my baby was just like, no, he didn't care, he didn't like even a newborn. How do they know? I don't like this. Thing. So, bassinet is something that you really need to pay attention because some bassinets the weight are very like just 15 pounds I recommend so here comes my tip number one when your baby born you're really gonna get to know how he gonna react to with the new environment you know so you need to wait a little bit about this so when my baby was here i was just saying bassinet's not working crib is not working he just want to be in my arms he didn't want to be flat he never want to lay down flat my baby had gas and reflux so i will recommend to you the rocking sleeper i'm gonna show you a picture here this is my favorite brand from fisher price i love it because my baby slept so much better came to buy a bassinet wait a moment until your baby gets here but i really highly recommend you to buy a rocking sleeper number two is crib bedding they are so adorable they have so many different uh, themes. You know, it's cute. I think you should get is the protection for the sides. I'm gonna show you guys here in this picture. Is the, for me is the most important thing because when your baby gets around, see my baby transition from 
rocking slipper went to the crib when he was five months. So when I put his room for his sleep in his crib. All the cutie stuff that I put in his bed went out for safety. Don't expand a hundred dollars. So please don't waste your money. Just get some like clean sheets that you can put on there, cover the mattress. I really highly recommend to you guys get something that is like waterproof. You can find it in Amazon. A mattress cover that is waterproof. In a Number three, shoes. We may be obsessed with shoes, but our babies until they get a really in the toddler stage that they're gonna walk and stuff like that you're not gonna need shoes that's like you're gonna spend money with shoes it's gonna be waste i feel like personal my son he grows every two weeks because we have to buy clothes every two weeks for him and shoes i remember i got so many cute shoes when he was like newborn for for a month old he never used that I felt like very uncomfortable for him, you know, and babies doesn't need shoes. Wait until he's like trying to walk and you can try to buy some, I, I don't know exactly the name, but I call it. Number four, I thought it would be very necessary. I never heard about this before. Do you really want to leave a smelling diaper for days in this garbage baby garbage thing because seriously it's disgusting the refills are so expensive these few refills are so so expensive so please don't waste your money what i can tell you what you can do what i do i got a normal garbage so don't waste your money with diaper propel please please garbage can and that's it and I change it every single night before my baby goes to sleep so stay the whole day I use the whole day and then in the night I just put in the trash the number five is a changing pad cover I mean, when I look back everything that I did you know I was like I should have used that money for something else that you not gonna need because your baby is going to have explosions and stuff like that and then you're gonna see oh my god what a mess my changing pad was waterproof and this uh, pad every time that my baby actually have an accident i wipe and it's clean again i don't need like oh my god i have to throw in the washer and how what i gonna do in an accident and i was just like i never really use them so that's my five things that I realized after a while that I didn't really with you guys. So I'm really happy about this collaboration. Please go check it out to these other moms. They have so much to tell you guys. Thank you so much for watching my channel. Appreciate your interaction with me. Thank you so much for watching my vlog guys. See you next time.